What's up, everybody? Miss Montana Deleon here with another, I guess, positivity of the day video. Um, I, t I put something on my Facebook status recently about... So, this particular night, I guess, Basketball Wives is on or Love and Hip Hop or something like that was on and everybody was talking, every female was talking about this show. Oh, and did you see what she did? Oh, la, la, la. I'm getting sick of this show and she's all hood and blah, 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 but they keep up with the show. And this is what I did not understand. I would not watch the show. I did watch Single Ladies when it was on because I love Lisa Ray. I love her. And I love Spacey Dash. Okay, so, and then Lauren London made a little quick debut on the show early on in the show so i love that show and it kind of remind, reminded me of the black sex in the city so but the basketball wise and the love and hip-hop is a lot of fighting a lot of ignorance a lot of degrading of these women that are on the show i'm not going to say the degrading of black women because they have all mixed women or whatever and these are just these particular women that choose to be on the show um these are how black women these black women are being portrayed because they choose to. I see people talk about all the time, oh, we they get a black women these roles. They're not giving it to them to them. These black women are accepting these roles. They're accepting the reality show roles. They are accepting the video girl, video model roles, which I used to be. We accepted this. We were like, oh, they're offering her, okay, let me give you this job. I want you to drink. I want you to fight. I want you to act ignorant and ghetto and hood, and I want you to represent. You know, your people, and are you going to take the job? And everybody was like, shit, if I could be famous, yeah, I'm going to do it. You accepted the position. You accepted the representation. So they're not portraying black women like this. Black women are accepting these roles. You can say no to these jobs. I've seen uh, or heard about uh, Angela Bassett turning down a lot of stuff. I heard she even turned down Monster's Ball where um, Holly Berry was dumping, oh boy, like, make me feel good. Like, literally, Holly Berry was um, taking, taking on roles or Angela Bassett was not taking certain roles because she was just like, I'm not going to be portrayed like that. I'm sorry. I'll turn that down. I don't care if she got an Oscar for being hung by this guy. On, no, it's not. That's not my style. I'm not going to go out like that. Angela Bassett just sits stern in what she wants to be portrayed as and how she wants to be seen. And I... I salute her for that. You know what I'm saying? Holly Berry doing her thing too. I'm not knocking her. But Angela Best, like, mm mm, boo boo. I'm not, I ain't selling myself for that. No, no, I'm not no Oscar. I'm sorry. I'm cool on that. I'll pass. I'll take something else. I'll wait. I'll get my day one day, but I'm not going to go out like that, boo. So I really appreciate Angela Bassett for standing up for what she believes in and caring about how she's being portrayed. Another thing I'll say about the basketball wise and all the other stuff, I cannot stand to sit and watch some, I don't even watch TV, first of all. I'm on a computer most of the time. My TV probably goes on maybe once a month. But I cannot stand to watch such... It, it burns my brain cells to see such ignorant violence. Like, are you serious? Really? A show about a whole bunch of women just really going at it and I humped your husband and I humped your boyfriend and I'm going to beat you up. And I cannot sit there and watch that. Like, what am I taking away from that? Is it entertainment to see other people's misery? Like, I cannot be... You are what you take part in. You People can... can kind of get a feel for you or what you take part in what you do in your life if you type of person to run marathons you know you're an athletic person i can take from that you're the type of person to always go to charity events and be giving you're a giving person and if you're the type of person that want to sit there and watch a whole bunch of black women and spanish women and mixed women fight and hump each other's boyfriends and baby daddies and men and you know beg for hands in marriage and threaten people to, for them to marry them and, all, and fight and drink and just those you know all type of blows that says a lot about what you want to feed your body, your mind, your soul, your spirit. That says a lot about you. I was reading a Law of Success by Napoleon Hill that night. Um, it's a really thick book, too. Like, it's a really thick book. But I was reading Napoleon Hill, Law of Success, that night when everybody was tweeting. I was like, what? I mean, like, this is what I choose to do with my time. I choose to research, research <clears throat> relationship stuff and how to self-improvement, self-empowerment stuff and how to better myself. I don't want to feed my brain this chick fighting that chick and she all into it. And you know what I'm saying? They not These girls are not missing the season, not missing the episode. Honey, they glued to the TV like, well, I got to go home. I got to DVR. I got to see this stuff. You are what you eat. So this is what you want to take into your brain and put into your spirit. What does that say about you? Like, why would you even condone this why would you even give into the ratings and help them you know be high rate like why so something so negative 
I mean, it, it's just the way of the world. Sex violence and gossip and drugs and all that stuff sells. It just sells. That's how society has made it. Unfortunately, we are brainwashed to be attracted to that type of stuff. But, I mean, it is what it is. Everybody choose to do what you want to do. If you want to feed your brain that, feed your spirit that, take that into your world, and that entertains you, fine, do that. But me personally, I'd rather not take part into it. Like I said, I feel my brain cells burning away when I watch some crap like that. I, how, how is that going to better my life? I don't get it. I don't, I don't, that's just me personally. I would rather read a book or, you know, do something else that's, just the betterment of me and my family or whatever. I cannot take part in some bull crap. I can't. I can't support that. That's just me. That's just my little view on it. So, y'all got y'all opinion and what y'all do with y'all life and why y'all do it. Y'all don't have to explain to me why y'all watch it. That's you. I, this is me, Montana DeLeon's channel. I don't want to do it. I'd rather feed my brain and my spirit and my soul something positive that's going to help me in the long run. That's just me. Love some. And mama, you need to stop watching that show too because my mama watched that show. 